quick Q and A then, maybe fifteen questions, just a quick fire answers. Uh, yeah. Who's your toughest opponent? Uh, toughest opponent, I would say Neil McGee from Trinity. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, always familiar, always cross paths a lot, so it's difficult. Yeah. Uh, team you most like to beat? Ah, uh, Jakers. Um, <laughs> uh, so your your next door neighbours? I probably have their own. There is probably two. Proudest day in GA? Uh, Club or county? Club day, 2012, All Ireland is right up there. Yeah. Um, what's your most disappointing day in GA? Oh, geez. I'll tell you, Saturday's not not far away, or 2014 All Ireland was yeah. a difficult one. Who's been the biggest influence on you? Because uh, of the and lots, I'd have to say the, the parents. Yeah. Too, yeah. Who's the joker on the panel? There's a, there's a lot of them now. Um, Frank McGlynn is always the right man for the joke because I say he's maybe one of the elder statesmen, but he's a, a young fella at heart and he's never, never too far, far away from a prank. I thought Neil McGee might be in there as well. Uh, close second. Uh, who's the best dressed? I'd be one of the young fellas anyway. Uh, used to be Neil Gallagher from the old days. I used to rock up with the, the jeans and ASIC, so <laughs> we away from him now. So one of the younger lads, Brendan McCall or something like that. And who's the worst dressed? I'd say I rank, rank fairly high up that myself. <laughs> uh. um, who's the player you most admire from another sport? Another sport? Jakers. Uh, I love, uh, kind of love all sports now. I've been watching away at a, a right few of them. Mm. Uh, Richie McCaw was always somebody I would have always looked at the All Blacks, just the level of consistency we would play at. Um, he would have always been one. Manager from another sport? Uh, Bill Belichick. Uh, yeah. Patriots, yeah. Just that yeah. consistency? Just again, that's that level of to be continue to be at it and want to be at it and the drive to keep staying there. Like It's, um, yeah, it's, it's something. That Who loves the media attention? Who loves the media? Hugh McFadden has definitely taken it on a stride now. Yeah. He's, he's taken it on board nicely now, so it's <laughs> no bother then. Who thinks the women love him? Uh, man, man, there's, there's a few of the younger boys now that definitely see themselves see themselves up there now. And one McGettigan there from Lentis now is he's, he's one of the one of the newer boys. <laughs> and if you could transfer one player in the history of football to Donegal right now, who would it be? Gaelic. Uh, yeah. Do, 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 do. Uh, uh, Jakers, probably the Marsh was Gerald growing up, yeah. Just class. Ah, uh, just had it in I think the modern day game now, just having down to a tee, you know. Yeah. What was the toughest training camp you've ever done? Training camp, uh did uh geez, we've done tough ones now. Um, so I believe. <laughs> training camps we did one week before games back maybe in Jimmy Guinness's time. Um two thousand fourteen actually the the Saturday, Sunday before the, the Dublin game in 14, rank was right up there. Okay. Yeah. Uh, best speech you ever heard? From someone inside or outside the camp? Ah, uh, gee. I don't know, from somebody probably we didn't ever ever expect to, probably. Um, oh, listen, it was very fortunate, Jim Rory, Declan, John Jodardi, back in his time with me in the early part of the career, I remember him speaking well on uh, numerous occasions when things were, were tough for us so mm. fronting up and being able to do that in them times was, was always difficult and, 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 and he did it so he'd, he'd rank up there with one of them. And a final question then, what's the best game you're ever at? Best game ever at? Yeah, uh, any sport? Uh, ever at. Oh, mate, eh? um, it's a tough one now. Liverpool, Liverpool played Liverpool Villarreal at a soccer game in Anfield a couple of years ago, Europa League. The final. I think I remember remember them playing. The place was hot and buzzing that day. They had a they had to come back from a defeat in the first leg, and they, they did. Anfield just kind of sucked them over the line now. So that was one of them. Great stuff, and congrats All on the best. player of the month.